Drama Art Nation. I'm your host, Killer Keemstar. Let's get right into the news. <clears throat> anyway, I just want to make this video to give you like an update on the channel. Just, you know, how things are going, basically. I haven't really made a video just kind of speaking to you guys, really. And I thought I would make one. Yeah, first things first, I'm going to be deleting a few of my videos. Um, I'm not, I'm not going to be deleting any of the... Um, any of my music videos, they're gonna stay. I'm gonna be deleting some of my older videos, the ones that are, um, yeah, the cringy ones, the, cr the cringy old ones that I've made that aren't music related. Um, I'm gonna be deleting some of those because I want, I want my channel to be a focus on music. Um, I'm probably, I don't really normally record myself, so I'm probably gonna be looking in the viewfinder over here instead of like directly at the camera. But um, I'm just going to be deleting some of the old videos that aren't music related because I want my channel to be a focus on music rather... Like, I don't want people to come to my channel from the older videos and be like, oh, his channel's all about some some guy mowing a lawn and speeding it up to like 64 times the speed, you know, because I made a video like that for, for whatever reason. So, <clears throat> yeah, I want, I want my channel to be mainly focused on music and not those older videos that I made a while ago when I was young and I had no idea what I was doing. I mean, I still don't have much of an idea what I'm doing, really. I just kind of make music and hope <laughs> it gets popular. Which brings me to the next thing I want to talk about, um, how popular some of my videos have been getting. I, I never expected some of my videos to be getting the views they are now. Like, th things like the Universal Studios theme and the Warner Brothers theme and the 20th Century Fox have been getting insane views. Like, my most popular video at the moment is sitting close to 90,000 views and like that's amazing I didn't think I didn't think I'd be able to get a video to that <clears throat> to that point and yeah I like I seriously just love making music and I love making music and just like you know just sh sharing my talent with people and I want to make I want to make something that I would want to listen to and I want to make something that people would uh, as well like also <laughs> also enjoy listening to like i'm freaking speaking today music is something that i want to make a career out of like i can't see myself working in an office or just working in fast food or retail or anything like that for the rest of my life like i just want to make music like it's my passion potatoes are what i'm mashing that's my it's my bio on twitter music is my <laughs> passion potatoes are what i'm mashing anyway I'm getting off track. What's the next thing I want to talk about? I do have more music covers coming. I have a big one that I'm going to be working on with my friend Elisha. He is a drummer. Um, goes to my church, and oh man, I'm so excited. I'm not going to tell you guys what it is because I want to, you know, kind of build the build the tension, get the get the thing flowing, whatever that thing is called, the freaking excitement. Um, yeah, that word. I have more song covers coming, and I'm actually at the moment working on. If you can see here. This is the tab for the DreamWorks theme. Um, I'm working on that as well as at the same time, I'm gonna include in the same video another studio fanfare. I'm not gonna tell you guys what that is because I want it to be secret and then I want you to find out when it comes out because that's, I don't know, that's just what people do, I guess. Another thing is that um, it's pretty difficult at the moment to work on music just in the state that uh, I mean, I'm not, I'm not like complaining or anything. Like, I think I have, I'm pretty well off in terms of like housing and everything. But like, I just find it very hard to work in this space that I'm given. Like, if you can look, if you can look down here. Like, this is just my computer and like, not, not, not my computer. My, my brother's computer and I, because I live with my family at the moment. I live with my nan, my mum, and my brother. We all share the, share the same house, and it's quite a small house, so it makes it really difficult to actually get any music recorded because I record everything in the living room and this is generally the room, like I'll just give you a quick pan around now, like this is just the living room that I'm in right now. And you know, it kind of makes it difficult to work on music when everyone's in the same room. People are like, you know, watching TV over here, I don't know if you can see that. People are watching TV over here, sitting around eating dinner and everything and my mum is over on the other computer trying to work on her university studies and Tate has to study on this computer back here and you know it, it makes it really difficult to actually work on music just as a whole I guess. Um, I'll give you a little look at my little recording bay. Um, 
So that right there is my Lexicon Alpha. That is what I is a hardware that I use to record um, guitar onto, and that basically runs into Audacity. But this is a hardware I use to capture my guitar recording, and I actually just ordered a new one because my what well, my friend the way my friend described it to me is but basically the Lexicon Alpha is not a very good um, <laughs> is not a very good recording hardware. I don't I don't know the like official title for the Lexicon Alpha, what what kind of device it is. I just call it recording hardware, but like it's it's just it's just not very good. It's very it's pretty old and it's um like it was it was previously owned by one of my other my one of my friends one of my friend friends friends and he kind of uh gave it to me and didn't tell the friend about it. I don't know if his friend actually wants it back or not if, or if he's missing it or whatever, but I kind of took it. I can't even remember if I paid for it or not. I was supposed to. Anyway, but um, I bought a new one just today for... Let's just say I bought it for a lot of money. Um, I bought a new one today just because I want higher quality sound and I just, I need everything to be as high quality as it can be. And at the moment, the sound quality for my guitar is okay, but it's not great. So yeah, I bought a new um, recording hardware device, whatever you want to call it. So hopefully I can get my guitar to sound just generally better. Um, yeah, I mean, that's the hope. And also, so I encountered a problem with my amp. Um, and just, just today, actually, I encountered a problem with my amp and it was making um, these sounds as I was recording. So this is kind of, this is pretty much what my amp sounds like at the moment. I cannot, I could not tell you what that sound is, so I think I'm going to need to get a new amplifier. Um, if I don't, then that sound is going to absolutely come through. Oh, hello. Yeah, if I don't get a new amplifier, that sound is absolutely going to come through on the recording, so I don't, I think I'm going to have to get rid of my amp after about seven years of running. But you know what? Whatever. I mean, I don't have the money to buy a new amplifier at the moment, but I will. I will eventually. Once I get paid by work, I will have the money for a new amp. So at the moment, I'm not actually able to record any music as of now, but I am definitely writing up some new covers for you, like you saw the DreamWorks thing back there. And I'm working on a fairly big cover with a friend of mine that I think you are all going to enjoy very much. And uh, now onto some sad news. My, the the uh the man, uh who taught me guitar, who like, you know, who I first started playing guitar with, um, he actually passed away, on the weekend. Um, yeah, I just thought I'd bring that up because I, like, uh, I don't know. I don't just. It was such a shock to me. Like I was on Facebook and my friend just like posted a photo of. Merrick, my my old guitar teacher, and it was like he just it just basically said that you know he had passed away, and I was like, you know, this is a guy that taught me how to play guitar, and I don't think I think without Merrick, I wouldn't be at the level that I am today. Like he pretty much taught me everything I needed to know and get started on guitar, you know. And once I learned everything I needed to know, I kind of just you know took off. You know, he, he, he kind of just said, you know, oh, Riley, you've kind of, you know, overtaken me in skill level. That's, that's not me trying to brag at all. Like, I'm, that, I'm just, I just want to give a reason, you know, for why, for why I stopped taking lessons. But, you know, he was a great guitar teacher. And I think also, like, we had very different, we had very different styles and very different ways of looking at music. So that was another reason. But yeah, I just, I wish, I really, really wish I had gotten the chance to see him before he had passed away because I never got the chance to actually show him how far I'd come with my music and what I was doing, you know, I, and it just, it was only something that crossed my mind a few times and like, as soon as I found out that he had passed away, I was just like, freak, you know, I'd, I'd never got the chance to show him how far I'd come with my music, like, show him how it was going, I guess. 
But yeah, um, uh, so that is all I have for you guys today. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was kind of random. I just decided that I should bring you guys up to speed and show, tell you guys what's going on and what I'm working on. And yeah, I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna struggle working. I'm, like, I'm gonna be honest. I'm probably gonna struggle working on music um, with work, with the amount of, like with work, like me having to work and like you know go and find work because I actually. I need to work to live, you know, I kind of kind of need money and you know, as much as I wish I could have YouTube as my job, it's not really a reality at this point, but you know, one day, I don't know, at this point it's just a hobby, but you know, it's just going to be hard to work on music while working and volunteering. Um, which will hopefully be in a few weeks time. I need to get a new amp because mine is, I think it's busted. I think it's, I think it's dead. <laughs> so yeah, new video coming as soon as I can, as soon as I possibly can get it to you. I swear on my life, I'm going to get a new video, at least one, one or two videos every month. I swear on my life. That is my goal. Anyway, I'm, I'm done. I'm done talking. Goodbye everyone.